Welcome to Epic IQ. A place to sharpen your logical and lateral thinking skills. Three bugs problem was made famous by being frequently asked in Microsoft interviews. The problem goes like this. There is an equilateral triangle and three bugs are sitting on the three corners of the triangle. Each of the bugs picks up a random direction and starts walking along the edge of the equilateral triangle. What is the probability that none of the bugs crash into each other? You may pause the video to think of the answer. Here is a hint. Think of it, the bugs can avoid the collision only when all three of them, decide to move in the same direction, be it clockwise or anti-clockwise. What is the probability for that? The answer is To avoid collision, all three bugs together, have to either move in clockwise or anti-clockwise direction. So, probability of no collision is the sum of probabilities of bugs moving in either clockwise or anti-clockwise direction. The probability of choosing a specific direction is half as each bug has two choices. Hence the probability will be half multiplied by half multiplied by half plus half multiplied by half multiplied by half. Thus the probability of bugs not colliding into each other is 0.25 or 1 by 4. Now, here is a problem to solve for you. What if there are four bugs at each corner of a square and they pick up a random direction to start walking along the edge? What will be the probability of them not colliding into each other? Share your feedback in the comment and don't forget to subscribe or suggest a puzzle. Cheers! Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you love solving puzzles and brain teasers. Defective Ball in the Box is again a very popular puzzle and has been asked in many top interviews. You have 10 boxes that contains balls from different manufacturers, with each of the ball weighing 10 grams precisely. One of the manufacturer made a mistake and its balls weigh 9 grams each. You don't know which box contains the defective balls. You have been provided with an electronic weighing machine but you are allowed to use it only once. How will you find out, which box contains the defective balls?